guys, what's up? So today I'm with my friends Derry and TJ and today we're going to be doing a story time as to why we got arrested. Yes. <laughs> Before we start this video, make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Also give me a thumbs up as well as click the little bell button to be notified anytime I post a new video. Okay guys, let's get started. It started on one frightful autumn night. <laughs> Be us I, <laughs> well, first of all, it was my idea at first. Uh, I hit him up and then I told him I want to do a Halloween video for some odd reason. Purge theme. Yeah, purge, yeah, theme. purge theme. So I was it was like, a great idea yeah. at the at the moment. <laughs> at the moment. <laughs> we at we the did time. not see where this was going. So, you know, I hit up a couple people and then um, we picked a day and we picked a time and a location to meet up. And it was at his apartment we met up, uh, what, 7, 7 p.m. we met up? <laughs> but we didn't leave the apartment till like what nine o'clock. So ten, almost <laughs> oh my ten. god! Yeah, so we were like two. All the girls had to do their makeups. People were over here putting fake blood on themselves. We yes. had their costumes together. We walked out looking like some clowns. People <laughs> were making a conscious effort to walk on the other side of the so sidewalk from us. They right. were not fucking with us. So we get to the apartment and uh, we um, waited for everybody else to get there. And then when everybody got there. It was some more people that came that we didn't even invite. So it was like, it was really crazy. They were already inside. Right. So we left the apartment. Oh, we have to, we have to tell them where we were going though. <laughs> the scene for this entire Perch theme shoot was this abandoned hotel. It used to be the biggest hotel in Houston in the United States, but shut down, has a whole bunch of falling apart things inside, spray paint. It's, it's just, it's terrible now. But it was a perfect place for a creepy video shoot. We pull up to the spot, you know, in costume with our props and whatnot. Um, of course, everything is safe. Nothing is a real weapon. But, you know. Except for his machete. Hey, the machete was real, though. But oh, then, no. Yeah. We had, like, a bunch of BB guns and stuff. But go ahead. But then, uh, a couple hood African Americans pull up <laughs> with the Draco. With the Draco. With the real Draco. I'm talking water gun emoji, man. <laughs> At first, I'm like, oh, that's fake, right? And he's like, nah, bro. I be popping this whole up. I was like, dog. <laughs> well, we, we, got, we, get to the, we get to the spot of the shooting. We met up with some other people that we didn't know. We never met before, but they just happened to be there. And this is weird because this place is like nobody goes there. So seeing them at the spot at, at 9 p.m. At the same time right, we were. It was crazy. So we start shooting. You know, it was dark. We had to climb like, what, eight stairs like, just to get to yeah. the mm -hmm. sixth floor. So... We get there and then we start shooting and some random guys come in and then, you know, they should, they started like hanging around us where we were shooting at and stuff like that. And it was just being crazy. And one of the guys, like, I think, what did he do? He like broke the window or like, what happened yeah. with that guy? Oh, but before we like went into the hotel, there was these sketchy ass cops oh, yeah, that yeah, were yeah, like yeah. near us. And I remember Jerry and I went over and we were like, hey, don't be alarmed. Like we're going to just be shooting outside right. the hotel. <laughs> So they wouldn't be like sketched out and just keep an eye on us, but they were like, no, 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 it's it fine. Turns out they thing. didn't care about us at all. Yeah. Two cops parked next to each other, not looking our direction, yeah. having a conversation. They were literally just eating. Like. Yeah, but we were too nervous because we had all those weapons and yeah. Yeah. fake guns blood, and stuff like that. And we're black. On yeah, exactly. We're not hurt. <laughs> While we're climbing up those 16, exaggeration, flight of stairs, <laughs> it comes out that the, the people that were with us that we didn't know we're actually acquainted with one of the actors that were with us. So we specifically told many, many times, do not bring anybody. This is a closed shoot. Regardless, he invited them. He said, we might need some protection. <laughs> From what? What? Point. <laughs> what? what? We get to the top, you know, Jerry's over here trying to direct it. He's getting all of us that were invited together to do our thing. The other people, they're just being hood rats. they breaking stuff, they throwing stuff off so the edge. They were being so Mind you, it's like 10 at night, almost 11, like yeah. you can hear things yeah. like, and we were on yeah. the sixth floor, it's not that high up from like, right. society. And, and the cops were still down there, so yeah. it's like, there were still cops down there around and we were just, they were just being like stupid loud and stuff while we were trying to shoot. They were doing stuff like spray painting the walls, which is expected in an abandoned building, but then they're throwing, <laughs> hey, chill, chill, no snitching. <laughs> But hey, that's what I'm saying. It's not that bad. But then yeah. they would throw the can off the side of the building. Right. Dog. Yeah, and there was like they were throwing some metals, which was making the like really loud, loud sound. metal sound that would hit the floor. It was it was crazy. And they were trying to break a window. Yeah, mind you, there are a lot of broken windows, a lot of broken um, planks of wood sticking around. 
So these people, their destructive mindset just clicks in. They're like, let's break some more stuff. Right. They start throwing shit at windows, like chairs, wooden bars, whatnot. Um, and we just going on doing our thing, but we're hearing these banging noises yeah. in the background. We're getting really nervous at this point. And I remember Jerry telling me like, all yeah. right, we're going to have to wrap this yeah. up. The last scene was going to be like me hitting at a window that was already broken. broken. Yeah, so we weren't going to be making any noise like that to the very end. And that noise, that last scene was going to be like the last one where we just leave. So it's yeah. like, we it's can make the noise, about. but we like get out of the challenge. Like, so, <laughs> <laughs> like, we're shooting and everything's fine, everything's normal, except from the loud sound that those other guys were making. And then yeah. it was time to go because I, I didn't really feel no, safe. No, literally, as I'm hitting the window, this girl, the other girl, a part of this video, comes up to us and she was like, yeah. there's something sirens downstairs yeah. so okay we, this is my first time hearing all that <laughs> it's just i have my sixth sense my black mom in me like i didn't hear no sirens or nothing i just felt the need like it's, it's time to go so yeah now it's making noise now we hear cops are coming and, you know the yeah. first thing we think of is we gotta get out of here but now we have weapons fake weapons with us that we can't run out the hotel yeah, with because then be yeah so you know we we're rushing down the stairs, six more stairs down, and then... Hold on, when I was running downstairs, I had these huge heels. <laughs> With a big and ass I back. Remember, I slipped, and TJ caught me, basically <laughs> saved my life. I didn't even know that. Oh my god. It was God. adrenaline. I, I barely remembered that till now. <laughs> so but we... these people, they were the smart ones. They heard the information. They were leading the pack. I was in the back. We were the only three ones that were smart enough to leave right yeah. then and there. But me in the back of Everyone the line. Everyone was hiding. I saw some shit before we got out of there. Right. They were already halfway down the staircase. But me, I was walking through the door. One of the random guys stopped me. And he said, my friend is bleeding. And I look at his leg. Dog. Biggest hole in his thigh. Hole. With, a giant, picture, with a giant splinter. The picture should be right about here over Melissa's face. <laughs> but... Um, he said, dog, my friend is bleeding. I watch too many movies. I'm not stopping for you, nigga. <laughs> That's what we gotta get. We gotta go. <laughs> like, I look at his leg. I see it look like he got shot. I said, okay, there ain't nothing we can do here. Doom, 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 doom. We make it all the way down to the bottom uh, stair, the first floor. Now, I think we were the first one down there. Yeah, and it the was cop literally Jerry, me, and TJ right behind. Yeah. So the cop was like, don't hold up, no, 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 not yet, not yet. Because we make it down to the first floor, and that it's not like the door is right in front. We got to go around the corner, yeah. right. and we have to move this little piece of wood over a hole to get out. We right. So we make it around that corner, we drift in like some Mario Kart. Flashlights. Yeah. And then, on Jerry. And I was like, flashlights were on us both, dog. I hit that corner back because <laughs> I had the I had the choppers in my hand. And I had the camera in my hand, so I couldn't make any sudden movement because oh I dropped it. Some you know, so we I thought I was about to watch you die, dog. <laughs> I saw the flashlight and the first thing that that came to my head was just just give up. Yeah. Just, get on your, just get on your knees and get out, bro, because I was not going to take uh -huh, the chance. That's how you get out of everything, huh? <laughs> <laughs> hey, nah, nah. <laughs> so the cop was like, come out, or we send the dogs in. And I'm like, dogs? First of all, I hate dogs, so we are Regular dogs. It could be a chihuahua. I don't care how small the dog it is. It don't even have to be no police trained canine. <laughs> unit. So he could have been lying, but as soon as he said, Dog? Come out or we bring the dogs in. I was, I came out. I was like, you got me, bro. <laughs> Jerry had his camera equipment on me. Meanwhile, me and Melissa, we're ducking back. We run halfway up the first staircase and we are throwing our yeah, fake weapons yeah. in between the floors. And those were mine. I was like, what? Yeah, Jerry lost two expensive uh, Machete. machetes. Machete. I don't know whose BB guns those were. I'm pretty sure those were Matt's. <laughs> Yeah, Matt's uh, BB pistol. Yeah, I know that one was no a little bit expensive because that was from back in his days. <laughs> There's no way I'm about to walk out orange tip or not. I'm not about to walk up to no cops with flashlights. I live in a abandoned building covered in fake blood with a, a BB gun. When I came out, he was like, how many people are back there? And I think you followed right behind me. No, I didn't. Me and TJ were literally huddled up in the corner. We're and debating. I was, do we we were up? like, what do we do? Yeah. What do we do? <laughs> And we're like, do we go out or do we go in? I'm like, yeah, I'm not about to like jump off the sixth story. So I mean, right. my only other option is to calmly walk out. Yeah. And I'm like, fuck, how do I make it look like I'm innocent as hell? With this There's thing? no yeah. way. Like, I remember totally you fucked. were like yelling at us. Yeah, yeah, like, I was like, hey, just come, out. come yeah. out. Yeah. I put on the LED on my camera. I turned on my camera. I unfolded my tripod. I put my camera bag around me, buttoned up my shirt, put my glasses <laughs> on. Make it I look like I my pants. <laughs> and I was walking out. <laughs> As soon as we were uh, all coming out one by one, as soon as 
We came out immediately. They handcuffed Hand us immediately. Right up, and they didn't even care how they did it. Literally, yeah. I was upside down. <laughs> yeah, Melissa on the side. No, it was me though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was me. It really was like this. Like I'm like what? But, but I, so we came out, and then I told them, "Alright, you guys just come out, so we don't have anybody get hurt." You know, because I don't really. I was not messing with those cop mm -hmm. issues. So I think there was just us three that, that came out. Literally, you know? oh, the three of us were sitting out there. The first ones. Everybody else is hiding upstairs because the guy is bleeding. I, I don't know how we made it down that staircase. Right? Uh, Matt is still up there. He rode with us because if Matt was there, then honestly, we would have just scoop, scoop. Bad. <laughs> <laughs> but I know Matt since high school. I did not know those other people, so I was in no home. Right. They say. Um, how many people are in there and our stories aren't adding up here's like two <laughs> five three, eight here's like three four i'm like uh one two melissa's <laughs> melissa's just like fuck I, know, I immediately was like you guys like what they the got fuck? It, got that's it. why i was like hold up i got the constitution i'm gonna plead the fifth <laughs> then they pull out the loudspeaker towards the building this is an HPD sergeant. I don't know what the fuck his name is. You cannot ride with a dog. If you don't come out right, the dog was sending the dogs in. He was with his dog, like, ready. Like, ready to, like, go in. And I'm already freaking out on the floor and hang up to this man because I seen a dog right there. So it was. And I'm not going to lie. I kind of smelled like something. So when I was first walking out the hole from the abandoned building, that dog was snapping, and, rawr, 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 and I was like, "Oh no, <laughs> not today, Lord! I just got a good grade on my test." Yeah. I think me and someone else were like the only ones handcuffed but, to yeah, ourselves. One, yeah. Yeah. And she had a, a face full of clown ma skull, clown I had a makeup, skull, the other girl had like clown. So we're yeah. talking. It's twelve a.m. in the morning. We're handcuffed on the floor in front of an abandoned. It's yeah. only twelve a.m. Because hold on, hold they on. kept us detained for so Mind long. Mind you. My dad is texting me nonstop. Where the fuck are you? <laughs> like, you need to be home right now. It's like really late. While I'm handcuffed, I'm literally like this. <laughs> it texting was a funny my show. dad. We have a picture of that thing. We have it a was, picture of that. It was literally like. I was recording on Snapchat, like, hey, it's lit, trying to make it look like we're innocent. It's the funny thing, we were tweeting lit. our ass off. Yeah, we were Snapchatting. We were trying to look like some innocent millennials just recording everything. Let everybody know. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. we're handcuffed right now. Literally the cop was like, I was scared. Put your phone away. Like, two or three times. <laughs> I'd rather be told, put my phone away than getting fucking Literally choked in my out head, I'm just sidewalk. like, TJ, put your phone away. I am not going to jail. And I was the one handcuffed to him, so if anything that went wrong, we'd have both been fucked. So. <laughs> Let me tell you, I'm an amazing actor. You can ask Jerry. I was a star facts, of that show. Facts, but you facts. know, sometimes you gotta know how to act like you're acting. So the cops thinking I'm acting a sore way, but okay. really they don't know that that's an act too. So really, now that's confusing, but if you think about it, it's, I, not. it's me. I'm the real reason no one got arrested. If I wasn't there, everybody would have been in jail right now dropping soap. <laughs> <laughs> so, well, whatever this is going on, I'm literally freaking out because... <laughs> Because I'm, I'm like, when it comes to following my dad's rules, I have to follow my dad's rules. If not, like, it's my head. So he's like, I don't care what you do. You have to be home right now. Like, come home right now. I'm literally like, I'm in handcuffs. Like, I can't go home right now. So I, like, told my dad this and that. And then um, in my head, I didn't know whether or not he didn't believe me. So I literally, like, asked the cop. I was like, hey... Do you mind talking to my dad for a second, telling him what's going on, telling him I'm like oh, stuck yeah. here, there's absolutely <laughs> nothing really I can fucked. do, I can't go home right now. So like I hand the phone to the cop and the cop's talking to him for a while and all I hear, like I can hear his loud ass voice, he was like, <laughs> I don't give a fuck, she has to be home right now. He's talking and to the, the cop. The cop the literally cop. gives me the, he hangs up on the cop and the cop literally gives me the phone and he's like. He's in bad. I'm like, what? <laughs> yeah, he's really mad. I'm just like, I'm just like take me to jail. <laughs> I don't want to go home. Take me to jail right now. Um, and then at this point, they had brought up the entire Houston Police Department. They must have been bored. There were so many cops. Many cops. There were news, news vans out there. You know, we're over here looking the other way. Thank God only one of them caught a couple of our faces, but the other ones didn't have anything on us. Literally, my face is like. <laughs> all over the video. All over the 
video. Your face is beat. Though. Hey. <laughs> Fact, my you're face, actually somebody my else. My face is literally like the main picture that you click play on. That's literally <laughs> yeah. my face. Okay, finally, we like left. Then we had to go back to TJ's place because that's where all of our cars were. I literally was like, pray for me, guys, because I'm about to go home. My dad's going to beat my ass. Uh, Y'all will never see me again. <laughs> Um, I get home, my dad was more disappointed than angry, so he was just like, I don't want to look I'm at your face right asleep. now. Yeah, he was like, I'm just like, I'm going to go to bed without supper. <laughs> so he wasn't that mad. So I was like, all right, bet. Like, you know what I mean? Like, the next morning, <laughs> I wake up to hella text messages, hella like, uh, DMs on my Instagram, DMs Twitter. on my Twitter. People asking, is this you? I click on the like first text and it has a link. Huh. We're on ABC News. <laughs> oh, 16 people break into an abandoned hotel to shoot. First of all, videos. it was like 12. It wasn't 16. Yeah, 16? They hyped that up so much. Where'd it get the other people from? We and don't even know. Other Houston photographers, models, videographers. Everyone or, was talking shit. Yeah, they're shaming like, oh, and that's why we don't tell anybody oh. about their spots. Yeah. Everyone knew about that spot. To, uh, and also they were like, wow, they're so stupid. They like... Yeah, they that, cut a hole on the wall. Like, like what? Like, that really? hole was already there. You think we, we put up with power tools <laughs> and we came prepared. That hole like, was like, already there. It just happened to be like that behind this like wooden like door. <laughs> <laughs> somebody, somebody knocked a hole in there. It was a big ass hole, so ain't no way we did that. No, we didn't do that. But, we don't have time. So wait, you literally. My dad, or I didn't know about like the video or anything. I didn't know how I was gonna break it to my dad. I was like, oh, I just got home. Or I had gotten home last night, he wasn't that mad, like, you know what I mean? How am I going to break it to him? Apparently, people from his job, he works in the military, yo, like, people from his job recognized me. They're and they were, like, mad roasting him, like, is this your daughter getting <laughs> oh, arrested? Yeah. At the end of the day, we weren't arrested. We were detained, we never saw the back of a cop car. It was a great experience, I mean, I wouldn't a take great? it. <laughs> it really was. I would take it back. Like if we were to go back and do it all over again, I'd probably oh, yeah. still do it again. It was, yeah. It was like, very I mean, I would only do it again if I knew we wouldn't get charges. Yeah. Right. <laughs> exactly. Oh well, yeah. Obviously. Because at the time, like we were, we were bullshitting hard. Like yeah. it was fake confidence, but you know, it worked. You know. Dude, I don't know how we got away with that. I mean, because. No. We really didn't do anything wrong. No, we, we didn't, really didn't. It was though. just trespassing. No, we didn't right. do anything wrong, but it looked so bad. It looked so bad. Crazy, it, so bad. Yeah. We did, without the cameras, you can like, explain what we were we doing. We didn't have the cameras yeah. with us. All we that cameras. Probably, we, it would have been a different story for sure. Yeah, they wouldn't have been asking us what happened. Because most, most of the time, that most of the time they were asking us questions. It was like I was like, the cameras right here. We were actually shooting a video in there. We weren't really doing nothing bad, so it was like... Yeah, I think you showed him video footage, right. too, huh? He was like, do you know going up there can make you sick? A lot of hobos there. I'm like, what the fuck did that got to do with me, son? <laughs> no, it did smell like feces. Yeah, it was nasty bad. as cheese. So, in conclusion, um, the video was posted. So we shot... Oh, I'll just put it... I'll add it to the... To app, like the end the of this video. Wow. And it was definitely a lit video. I just feel like the experience, it was one of those things where the experience could not be captured by a camera. Yeah, no. mind you, we had to cut it short because we had a lot, or he, Jerry had a lot more ideas for the video. Yeah. But considering the that whole thing the whole happened, we didn't fun. really get to finish it, yeah. so he cut it short. But anyway, guys, if you're still watching, hopefully you are. I hope you guys enjoyed this story time as to why we got arrested. Make sure to check Zips out, TJ out. It's sunny. I'll go ahead and link them down below so you can show them some love. Okay. Guys, make sure to give this a thumbs up. Also, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. If you guys would like me to do more videos with Jerry and TJ. We could run a talk show, low-key. Low-key. Key. And we oh. can do some prank videos. Hey, yeah. if you want to see oh, the, prank videos. Like this video. How many likes for more for a prank video? Two. Because okay. I will do Two it for likes. nothing. <laughs> Man, we just want to do some prank and just hopefully try to almost go to jail again. Like we almost did. <laughs> go to jail? I don't know about all that. I'm on my own. You're, you're, <laughs> you're on your own. own. Hey! I'm giving own. them the... Ah, y'all some fucked up dudes. Shit, Nah. But 60 likes for a next for a prank video for, for all three of us. For a prank video, yeah. yeah. It's gonna be lit too, so. Go ahead and send us suggestions, stuff you wanna hear. And if we don't get 60 about. likes, we might we're do, still it gonna do it anyway. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we're still gonna do it anyway. We team head ass 2017. We love ourselves. You ain't gotta love us. <laughs> Zap. <laughs> Hey. Oh God! Thank you. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Yay! <laughs> gang, 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 gang.